More news coming in this morning. Infiltration attempt forward in the LOC in the now Shera sector of Rajori district. What we know is that two terrorists have been neutralized based on inputs from intelligence agencies in Jammu and Kashmir police. Regarding a possible infiltration bid, an anti-infiltration operation was launched by the Indian Army on the intervening night of the 8th of September in general area, Naushera and Lan. Two terrorists have been neutralized. A large quantity of ammunition, war-like stores, have been recovered. Operation is in progress. Two AK-47 rifles, one pistol recovered so far. Going straight across to Sunil Ji, but on that story that he is tracking, Sunil, what more details can you share with us at this point in time? Well, Sneha, a major infiltration attempt has been foiled by the Indian Army along the line of control in Jammu and Kashmir's Rajuri districts and Naushera sector. What we are learning from our sources is that uh, that there was a specific input that the army had, and this input had come from uh, the intelligence agencies as well as from Jammu and Kashmir police. And after that, a massive operation was launched by the Indian Army, uh, you know, uh, at the Lam general area in Naushera sector of Rajuri district. And after that, the Indian Army got success. Two infiltrating Pakistani terrorists have been neutralized. And war-like, uh, you know, uh, stores have been recovered, including two AK-47 rifles and a pistol. So this is a major success for the security forces just ahead of the assembly elections in Jammu and Kashmir. And uh, remember, Sneha, Pakistan is rattled by the democratic process in Jammu and Kashmir, and that is why it wants to create disturbances in Jammu and Kashmir. It wants to create trouble in Jammu and Kashmir. But our alert troops on ground are foiling the material designs of Pakistan and terrorists. High alert has been sounded across the length and breadth of Jammu and Kashmir. This has been done to ensure that no untoward incident takes place just ahead of the assembly elections in Jammu and Kashmir. Thank you, you for the moment for getting us up to speed with those details, Sunil Bhatt, this morning.